and we are back here with this Cleveland Cavaliers My League, and we are still in November, uh, coming off a big win against the LA Lakers. LeBron's return didn't work out too well for him, ended up uh, defeating them there 108-100. So what we're going to do is continue on simp through here, and uh, really don't really expect much to this season. And we're going to try to get through this first season as quick as possible, really, and then you know, draft free and see what we can do. So really, Kevin Love is hurt right now. He's out for one to two weeks, so... Uh, the way that our, this team is going here, there's a possibility. I tried to trade him, you know, the you know, first right away. Uh, didn't really work out. Wanted to see how it would work with him. And, you know, it's not going to work with him. So I think when he comes back from injury, as we're going to sim here until he gets back, I think we're going to try to trade him right now. I mean, we might as well just go into full tank mode and just try to tank this whole season. We can take a look at the stands right here. Right now, fourth worst. Trying to look for some teams maybe we can uh, possibly trade with. Maybe a team that's looking to, like the Pacers. They're 7-17, seven and 17, but maybe if they get love, uh, it gives them a chance to get, you know, go further, maybe get into the playoffs. I mean, we hope we, we don't, but, you know, we can try something to that nature to where they take a gamble. So this is the trade we're going to try to pull off. Kevin Love, Shannon Fry. We'll give them our first round in 2023. Unprotected, they don't like it. So, but they offer up this. Let's see what we got here. Uh, young shooting guard, Oaba, undrafted. Don't really need him too much. Second rounder. So we get uh, Sabonis, actually. Interesting. Boren Bogdanovich and then Thaddeus Young. But we get their first round pick this year unprotected. So if they do finish really bad and you know, it's in the lottery, uh, it doesn't matter, we get it. And they take the trade. So, hey, not that bad of a trade. At least we got a first round pick. Really, it's all building, trying to build around Colin Sexton and Buddy Heal. Those are really the stars of this team. And really, I don't mind getting Thaddeus Young or, or Boren Bogdanovich or even uh, Sabonis. They're not too bad. I mean, I don't really expect much out of them. But, you know, let's go into, let's look, let's go into full tank mode here. And, um, you know, really can't. And then there's the, the winning season is not going to help us out at all. So we'll go into a game here now against the Bucks. I just want to see how we match up here against uh, you got the Greek Freak there. So it's going to be interesting to see how uh, that plays out. This Bucks team is not too bad, uh, sitting at 500. So let's see how you know we do against them with all the new pieces here. As right off the bat, there's Giannis just goes right in, gets two points. Uh, that was pretty simple. The defense is definitely going to lack with this team. That's for sure. I don't really see any, you know, big time defensive stoppers there. Maybe Bayambo in the middle, but really not whole lot. Ever. I don't. I'm not going to count Larry Nance as that great of a defender. So, I mean, we're going to definitely be lacking on the defensive end. So something we'll have to look at in the off season. But offensively, we shouldn't be half too bad. I mean, we don't have. You got some, Bogdanovich can shoot. Uh, uh, Buddy Heald, Rodney Hood guys down low that can, you know, at least convert there like Nance with a dunk. And then Colin Sexton's a pretty good passer. So, I mean, offensively, we shouldn't be too bad. Defensively, it's going to be it's gonna be rough for sure. As the Bucks, Elias so looking for three. Can't make it there. 8-8 eight, eight so far to the score in this ball game. Uh, we're playing them pretty good here so far. So that's good to see. Both teams still a little struggling. Larry Nance is going to get the end one there. Uh, let's see if he can hit the free throw, though take a three-point lead and he hits the free throw 11-8 lead here early in the first quarter and uh yeah Eric Bledsoe it's a good matchup here for Colin Sexton as he gets a nice screen roll off gets the foul almost gets the and one so so far like I said in this ball game the shooting's been a little bit struggling as you see Colin Sexton actually leading uh the NBA rookies here so far for points per game just about 17 a game as he hits both free throws yeah struggling to get some shots here but uh, Colin Sexton doing a good job. If you can't really make any shots, you know, drive to the lane, draw some fouls, and get to the free throw line. This is that's a great steal by Buddy Heald up to Colin Sexton. He throws it down, and this is what I, yeah, this is what we got to do. We just got to build around really these two guys, and maybe bring in, you know, maybe look at small forward, obviously power forward, center of the positions we're gonna have to look at. But I think going forward with Sexton and Heald. Uh, we're good to go there. And you got guys like Rodney Hood. There you go. Can come off the bench, give you some points, because that's going to be really uh, the biggest issue is getting guys off the bench that can give you some production, because I don't want Heald and Sexton just to go out, and then the production of the bench is just absolutely nowhere. So we got to at least build some sort of depth, too, as George Hill tries for three, cannot bring it down there. 
And they're going to get a last shot opportunity here for the first. But Cunningham's going to drive. He's going to go up to Snell, and they will draw the foul on Thaddeus Young. So Snell goes to the line for two as we're up three here, now down to two. It looks like we'll get the uh, last shot opportunity here of this first quarter. So he drills both, 23-22 to score. We got 11 seconds. Let's see what we can do here. Sexton bringing it up the court. Just ISO real quick. Now we'll get a little screen roll action from Sabonis. Sexton finds a bam. Nice pass. Nice pick and roll. Getting the dunk there. And now that should be the end as Delavadova is just going to throw that one up. And man, just about made it. But three point lead going into the second. So now we head into the second quarter here. Tie ball game, and really uh, so far we have a shut down the Greek freak and hasn't really got much from him. As you see, Boran Bogdanovic drills the three. So uh, that's the one thing about him. He Once he gets going, as we saw uh, last year in the playoffs in that pacers calf series, I mean, he can go off at any time. So uh, you always, uh, I always like those guys at least can come off the bench and drill the three, especially nowadays in the NBA. That is key for sure. But we have shut down Giannis so far. Haven't seen a whole lot of him, so that's what we're going to have to keep doing there. And, oh, no, there is Bledsoe to Giannis, and uh, let's hope that does not get him going. That's a just, yeah, big-time dunk. Is but Buddy Heel comes right back down, drills the three, and we remain a uh, four-point lead here. Is now Giannis going at it, and he is looking good here. Now starting to get a rhythm going, averaging 26 points per game here. That's got to be at least in the top 10, I would think, of scoring. Now trying to hit the three. Man, hitting the three, that's a little bit out of character. Uh, not really much of a shooter, but he's starting to take over and feeling it here in the second quarter. Look at him working on Larry Nance, and then gets the end one. That's actually Bogdanovich as he gets the end one. Now all of a sudden, just like that, Hits the free throw. He has 20 points in the game. I think he has about 10 points here in the last two minutes. Unbelievable. As Buddy Heald's going to answer right back at him. Hits the three. And now we find ourselves down seven points here because Giannis is going crazy here in the second. You got Eric Fletz on the drive. Hits it out to, um, for a three-pointer there. And now up 10. And we just can't find the offense, and the defense is just, like I said earlier, we don't have much of a defense, but it is looking bad as Colin Sexton's going to try to slow some things down here, get to the line, draw the foul there on Lopez as he jits the free throw. Uh, he's struggling a little bit offensively so far in this first half, but at least getting to the line and making some nice passes there. He has 8.5 assists on the game. As we get closer here to the end of the first half, Sexton trying to make some moves. Can't get anything. He's going to back it out, reset it here. Get a nice screen from Thaddeus Young. Throw it off to Young. Can he get it in there? And he cannot, but he gets the rebound. Back it back out. Sexton looking for maybe another screen to roll, pick and roll here. Go off the screen. He's going to throw it back down to Bayambo, actually. And he's going to go for three, and he can't get it. That's just a four shot. Really bad shot there. Walkie's going to try to get it up. Got about two seconds. Giannis for three, and he can't hit it. And that's where we will go to halftime. 53-47, to 47, and he took over. That man right there took over that second quarter. Uh, give the Bucks back the lead. You can see our shooting just awful. Getting out-rebounded by 12 at half, so that is going to have to stop. I mean, we do have six steals, but we're going to out rebound and they're shooting like that. It's going to be a rough, rough night. Down six here going into the third quarter. Sexton, he's got a wide open shot there. Take that. There we go. Drills that. Only a two. I think put on the line. Uh, but puts it within two here. So 55, 53, 10 minutes left in the third. Let's see if we can shut down Giannis here in this third. Because not second. And it doesn't look good there as that's an easy, nice little Euro step. Puts it in. He's got 26 points on the chaos game here so far. He has just taken over. But there we go. Good defense there by Bogdanovich. Throw it out to Buddy Heald. Wide open three. Drains it. That's what we need. Buddy Heald having a uh, pretty good game for him right now. 17 points on the game. He's looking like to be our leading scorer. It's now Sexton. And we'll play. You can see Buddy Heald rolling around. Gets a nice pick there by from Bayambo. Good feed. Good inside. There we go. Nice layup. And now we have uh, regained the lead here by three. So really good third quarter. And it seems like every game as Giannis just throws down the dunk right back. It seems like every game, though, uh, maybe the first half were a little slow. But coming out second half, this team makes adjustments. It looks pretty good going into the second half. So Zelia Sova drills the three and puts Milwaukee back up, too. So we got a little bit of a 
back and forth ball game here. Good game going on here in Milwaukee. So Sexton's going to bring this one up. Let's see, uh, pick and roll kind of working out as Larry Nance with the dunk. Nice feed from Sexton. Milwaukee's going to call a timeout because they have been struggling with that all game. Can't seem to defend it at all. So hopefully we can continue that. Leaving a wide open Roddy Hood in the corner. Not what you want to do. Drills the three. And we're back up once. So the back and forth game continues here. Once again, let's try this pick and roll action. Works out perfectly. Thaddeus Young with the dunk. Man, Milwaukee has got a little bit of troubles on that. Ilya Sova really struggling with that pick and roll. It's a one-point game, so we go by 245. It's still a one-point game, 72-71. Kind of pretty much calling the same play we did earlier, and it works out again. Buddy healed in there for the layup. He's got 21 on the game, and we got a one-point lead here with two minutes left in the third. What a game we got going here. As Snell going for three, he drills the three. Puts Milwaukee back up two. So uh, this is uh, maybe, it's really turned into actually a pretty good game. Defenses are playing, you know, relatively well, but the offenses are playing well as as well. But Milwaukee with the six-point lead, Buddy Hill with the steal, throws it to Thaddeus Young, gets the dunk, and one. We'll go to the line, try to make this a three-point play and put this back to a three-point deficit, but he cannot drill the free throw. Now we got 14 seconds left here in this third. Down six. Healed for three drills. And it'll put us back within three here. Ten seconds left. See if we can get a stop. Let's is going to bring it up. And uh, keep this at a three-point lead. As Delvadova is going to hit the three there. No, it's going to be off the rim. That should pretty much be the end of the third quarter. I don't think we're going to really get a shot off with uh, five-tenths of a second left. We'll try it. See if we can get anything here. Just move up the court with George Hill. And he's going to uh, act probably too late. It's no good anyway. But with three-point lead for Milwaukee. They had a nice run to end the third there. They take the three-point lead as we head into the fourth. But this game's looking pretty good. Head into the fourth. And now a two-point lead, 86-84. And uh, the screen to roll that time doesn't work. But a, a nice hit, hit off, I think. Was that Henson shoulder there? Right to Sabonis. And it works out. We've got a tie ball game here. So 9.30 left in this ball game. Giannis one on one, and he's got the and one. Man, that guy is just ridiculous. You can't, I don't know how you guard that. How much should Sabonis could do there as he drills the free throw and puts Milwaukee back up three. Let's see what our offense can do. So Colin Sexton trying to get it going. Heal. They're going to double healed. And Sabonis was there. Goes back to Sexton for three, and he drills it. Tie ball game. So, yeah, they're, they're all over Buddy Heald now because he has got a very good game going. And he, he takes the jumper really quick. Maybe expecting a double team. Doesn't work out. They get it down to transition down to Brogdon, and he is in for the score, putting Milwaukee back up four here. So we knocked it back to two. And Giannis with the drive. Foul and one again. That's his third of this ball game. Another one there. Let's see if he can not hit the free throw, though. And he's going to hit the free throw. So Milwaukee back up five with a three-point play from Giannis. And now it's a seven-point lead. Is trying to work it out in transition. Moves into the inside. Just cannot stop him. Puts it to nine. And Milwaukee now trying to put this one away. But nice job by Colin Sexton. Just coming right down the lane while Giannis is celebrating there. Finds the bonus on a nice pass. And all right, it's back to seven. 640 left. Sexton going down the lane. Man, nobody governed. What was that defense? That was horrible defense. Now it's back to five. And now here comes Buddy Heald. Next possession. It's down to three. So a nice run here by... We've got a nice run going. As you see, Heald with 26. We put it within three. So let's see if we get the stop. So now Bogdanovich as Now I'm starting to use her Bogdanovich because, man, the CPU, he was getting just lit up. And it works out perfectly with the stop. Healed for three. It's good. We're tied at 102. Nice job by this Cavs team. 11-2 run here in the last two minutes. Coming back. And it's back to a uh, tie ball game. 104-104. And now Sabonis drills the jumper there. 106-104. We've regained the lead. Battling back here in an excellent, excellent game here in Milwaukee. So now, like I said, I've been using Bogdanovich because... He was just getting annihilated with the computer, and it's working. We're playing some solid defense there on Giannis. Now to Bayambo. Can he drill that? No. So we got under uh, 225 left here. Tie ball game 106. Bledsoe with the Euro step, and it works out perfectly. 
Man, 108, 106 here. Two minutes left. This should be a great finish. Sexton driving to the hole, and he's got it there. Back to a tie ball game with two minutes left. He's got a pretty good game going after a slow start. Now let's see him back to Milwaukee. 150 left. And Leah Sova trying to find something. Can't find anything. Go down low. And we got some good defense there. He's going to try to put it up. Tough layup. Misses it, but gets his own board. Misses the second one. Rebound by Bayambo. Sexton's going to bring it up. 130 left. Tie ball game. Trying to set up a play here. See what we can do. Going to roll out. Sexton trying to find something. There's nobody open there. Nice defense by Milwaukee. Bogdanovich got it. Got six seconds on the shot clock. Trying to find something. He's going to have to force this one up. Two. One forces it up, shot clock goes off, and he drills the three. Bogdanovich with a huge shot there. Give us the three-point lead with 110 left. And now can we play some defense? Here's Giannis with the fadeaway, and it's good. Puts it in, back to a one-point game. He's got 48 points on this ball game, and now it is a one-point lead under a minute. So can we convert here on the offense? Going to slow it down a little bit. Waste some time with the uh, pick and roll action here. And they're going to double, but go down to Bayambo. He's going to swing it back out. And then what a cut by Bogdanovich. Sexton finding him. Puts it in for the layup. That was an excellent find there. And it's back to a three-point ball game here with 44 seconds left. And defense, we need a stop. So going outside to Bletso, forcing him to the inside. And it's stolen there by Sexton. Big steal. And now let's just try to waste some clock here and then make them play the foul game. And uh, we got 26 seconds left. We will have to take a shot, but if we can get a decent shot, get a layup or something, we can get something here. Screen and roll. Larry Nance is going down the center, and he dunks it in. Back to a five-point lead. Milwaukee's got to call a timeout. What a last few minutes here by this Cleveland team. You know, we might be trying to tank, but, man, they are playing well. I have to give them credit. They are just going all-out effort. So 17.9 seconds. Bucks need probably a two or three here just to do the foul game. They're going to try to go inside. Can't find anything. Time running out. Ilyasova is going to put one up for three. Cannot get it. Giannis with the rebound. Back to Ilyasova for another try. No good. We get the rebound by Bogdanovich, and that's the ball game. Great fourth quarter by this Cavs team. I think down nine with only about four to five minutes left in the ball game. Come back, nice run, get the lead. Excellent final two minutes to take this lead. Great defense down the stretch, and we get a victory. 115, 110. That was pretty, that was the most exciting game I've had on this uh, uh, my league so far. That was really exciting. You see Buddy Heal with 29, excellent game. Sexton with 19.16 assists. He had a great game. Uh, Bogdanovich hit, drilling that. It, important three there when it looked like we had nothing offensively and he comes through with that huge shot so it's, it's stuff like that like we're still going to try to get through this first season really quickly but you know guys like that I mean do we bring it back I'm trying I mean hopefully I think people the big time free agents will be there uh, and we're going to try to at least bring in somebody and guys like that if we can keep those guys around for the supporting cast I mean that will really help out yeah Giannis was just insane 48 points 10 rebounds 5 assists he was unstoppable the first quarter not too much but after that he just dominated uh, third quarter he didn't get as much time in there I think he was on the bench a decent amount but uh, wow see uh, our first half shooting 38% it wasn't looking good but look at the second half 65% we just started using that pick and roll action and Milwaukee had so much troubles with it it worked out um, excellent second half by this team so we get the victory but we're just going to keep simming ahead we'll go probably into yeah January um, I sure we'll find a game down the line to play um, not really I don't know, not really a whole lot to do. We'll just find some interesting teams to play. Uh, maybe check out some playoff teams. Maybe we'll play like Boston or Toronto. I mean, we might get annihilated. But it'd be cool to see how we kind of like match up, how Colin Sexton can work maybe against Kyrie or um, any of those guys. So you can see we're three down the list there. Don't really expect much for this season. But it was a fun game. Um, it's good to see Sex and Buddy Heald have great games, and hopefully that'll continue for the future of this team. So that's pretty much going to do it for this one. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. We will see you in the next one. Have a good one. Bye-bye.